Hey guys, it's here S2 and today I review the Shingon Lego Blick Dimensions Ninjago 4 pack vehicle set. So these are the boxes here. So uh, it's a four pack, obviously. So it's uh, recommended for your six craft and uh, this set. Uh, SY 752 and you get ABC day so the, uh, you got the one for Kai and it comes with 75 pieces and this one is for uh, J which comes with 75 pieces as well and I won't be showing you the alternative bits or else it will take very long and yeah here you got uh, Master Sensei Wu's uh, which come come with 72 pieces and here you got a white which is 72 pieces and uh, yeah so uh, you got the top of the boxes here so uh, you got the side of the boxes and the other side is just this thing uh, nothing really interesting so uh, this is the bottom here and yeah, uh, the so this is the back of the boxes. Shows shows you all the alternative alternative builds, and yeah, so that's it for the boxes. So uh, these are the instructions here. So you know, uh, let's see, this is all the alternate builds, and yeah, this is for the first one, and the second one is the J one. And you know, like, yeah, just pretty normal uh, instructions, very easy to follow, and yeah, like, really. And yeah, that's it for the instructions. So, uh, these are the uh, extra pieces here, so you can see they are like seriously a lot, like. You know, uh, there are quite a lot of studs actually, uh, especially for the gold studs. And you know, you got all these translucent studs, and you know, you got the blue stud, and uh, you got some cheese lope. Uh, you got this this handlebar, uh, this handlebar for the uh, for the water water bucket. And yeah, here uh, you got these one by one plate pieces, one by three plate pieces, and and only it's a, only a piece. But yeah, here you got this your piece, and also this uh, technique piece, and some extra hands as well. And yeah, uh, quite a lot of extra pieces. But yeah, that's it for the extra pieces. Alright, so first off for Mayfix, this is Kai here. Uh, so he, you can see he does have uh, his robot here. So let's start off by taking a look at uh, his robot. So you can see he, uh, the robot here does have the wrench and you know to fix his motor motorcycle. And it's on this weird kind of base, and it's it's kind of weird. Like the base of it is weird, and you know you, you got these arms here. You can move side to side, but you can't move up up and down but yeah you can you can move up and down you know just like this and uh, it does have the I guess like the radio signal kind of thing on the top you know represented by the lever piece and it does have his eye uh, so yeah uh, this is high here so uh, you can see he does have his moss of course and let's remove that and you know uh, his torso printing here like you know, just all the straps, you know, here, you got a symbol, and, you know, just the red, red printing, and, you know, some belts, uh, on his legs, you know, with leg printing, and you can see, uh, he does have his back armor, uh, holding his, uh, katana, and, yeah, he doesn't have any double-sided face, and this is face, his only face, and yeah, this is the back printing with the short, uh, katana holder. So yeah, pretty cool figure. 
So, uh, one thing I forgot to mention is that all these figures, they come with, uh, the base plate, which is nice. So, yeah, this is Jay here, the next figure, and, uh, he does also come with a robot, which looks a little more cooler. So, you can see, uh, the body here is just made up by these kind of weird grill pieces, and it does have, uh, its legs, and, uh, does have its arms, and, you know, you can move it around. Uh, but you know, uh, the, does have a pretty nice helmet. You know this thing. You can scan it, and yeah, you can move it up. And you know, it's on a printed uh, cylinder kind of piece, I believe. And yeah, printed cylinder piece, pretty cool. Like, yeah, it's a good printing. And yeah, nice that it it includes this helmet here. And yeah, let's just go that way. So. Uh, this is Jay here, the blue ninja, so uh, obviously does have his cow, and you remove it, you can see his face, and yeah, he does come, uh, he is armed with this uh, weapon, and yeah, it's like the official Lego one, and let's just remove that, and I just remove his hands, but yeah, so uh, his torture printing here is just like the Kai one, you know, pretty nice, uh, you got his symbol, you got his, you know, his ropes, and yeah, pretty nice printing. Does have uh, the the katana holder on the back, and surprisingly, does come with a set alternate expression. And this is the back printing, just like Kai. Uh, you got the katana holder printing. So uh, this is um. Sensei Wu here. I almost said Master Wu, but yeah, uh, so you can see he does have uh, his pretty nice uh, helmet here, this gold helmet, which is pretty cool. I, I don't know if it's called helmet or whatever, but yeah, you can see his face right in here is good, like, yeah, it's great, and it does come with his beard, and you know, you remove it, you can see his, uh, his mouth there, and yeah, so let's just remove it, and he does come with the this uh, golden stick, and yeah, uh, you can see the social printing here. Uh, just uh, you know, you have his ropes, and you know the symbol in the middle, and does have some light printing, pretty nice. And this is the back printing with the symbol on the back and some shurikens, I believe. And yeah, so, you know, overall pretty nice figure. So, uh, this is a uh, Lloyd here, the last figure. So, even though Lloyd is the green ninja, uh, you know, he has this, uh, golden armor. So, you know, that's... I guess different. So you can see, uh, does have his uh mask here, and you know you got uh, his face and no double sided expression. Yeah. So uh, you got his armor here, which is pretty nice, and does have two uh katanas on the back, and uh removing the armor you can see the torso printing. You know, you got his ropes, and you know just pretty nice printing like. You know, black printing, and the back here does have his symbol, and yeah, so, you know, pretty cool figure, but yeah, a weird one, but, you know, that's it for the figures. So, uh, these are all the builds here, so, uh, like I said earlier, uh, I won't be sh uh, showing the alternate builds, I'll only be uh, showing the uh, main builds. So let's start off uh, with Kai's. So uh, you can see it's on this base, obviously. So let's just remove it and you can take a look at the bike here. So you can see it does have fire. I guess these are the you know kind of exhaust. You know the exhaust bring out flame. And you know you got these wheels. You can move it around. And does have this sort of the front. I guess for like attack I don't know but yeah you know nothing really special on this thing like you know it's just mainly for display but you know pretty nice vehicle and it's nice that you can move it around so yeah uh, and then the J one here uh, he has his jet which I believe there is a 
like a full scale version of this and it, it's it's freaking annoying with this whole thing keep keep removing and you know it's on the jumper plates there and yeah so you can see this jet here uh, it's based off on the old uh an old jet that he he has but you know uh, so you can see does have uh, katanas on the side as well and you got the cockpit error and you know like nothing really special but you know here the back you got the exhaust you, know, you can move this around which is you know main the main feature and I guess these are the bottom exhausts I don't know but you know you can just fly this around but yes yeah, like just like I say it's just mainly for uh, display and for the game as well but this thing here is not really for the game but you know so this is a uh, master wu's uh not master wu i keep saying master wu is sensei wu's dragon kind of thing i'm pretty sure it's dragon but yeah so you can see it's uh it's actually uh flipped you know it's like uh upside down so you know this thing this stand has to be upside down so you know uh, they they Lego use the jumper plate, uh, the big jumper plate, which is you know pretty smart. So you you can see there is a lot of this go stuff. You know you can move this around. It's on this turning piece and does have its tail and you know it does have uh, his legs, the Brian's legs, which is pretty cool. And the head here, uh, you can see uh, Lego Lego use the a uh, bread piece, bread piece, uh, or the hot dog piece. I'm not sure as the like the head of it, which is pretty creative. And yeah, you got the front things here, and you know you can move this around. It's on hinge, and yeah, pretty interesting build here. I like it. But yeah, I'm not really interested on on these stuff. I only interested on the vehicles, but. Yeah, so this is a Lloyd's Dragon. So you can see it's raised up, uh, like really high, and it's also uh, upside down. And yeah, so you can see it does have uh, uh, the head here, and and uh, you know a lot of uh, katanas on the side as decoration decorations, and you can move this around. And you know does have uh, legs, and the back here is kind of plain. Maybe they should fill, fill it out with something, but you know, there's just the dragon here, so like re really, there's not much else to this. You know, you got the tail here represented by this thing, but yeah, so <clears throat> I guess that's like that's pretty much it for all the builds here. They are all very simple, and the reason that I didn't show the uh, outside builds it or is because or else this video would take like. 30 minutes, 30 minutes or whatever, like very long, so you know, but yeah, that's it for the vehicles. So overall, how do I think uh, of uh, this Shingon Ninjago Dimensions, Dimensions Ninjago's 4-pack vehicle set? So I think it's definitely pretty cool, like the figures, they are already built here, it's uh, good and you know, uh, like if you if you uh don't want the game, if you don't play the game, but you want the figures and also the builds, I definitely recommend you getting this because it's pretty cool. And if you are a Ninjago fan, uh, even you are not interested in the build, like you should get for figures as well. It's it's pretty cool, and you know it's pretty nice that Shinya made it, and I hope uh that they made it more, uh, but. Currently, it's only two. They only made two like dimensions copy sets, and the bootlegs they didn't copy much. Like, uh, Lily did copy the DC superheroes one, but aside from that, like only Shingyun and Lily is the only ones who copied the dimensions one. So you know, I definitely hope that they made it made like more dimensions copy stuff. So you know, so that uh, I can get it because I wanted the builds but I didn't want to play the game because like if you if you buy a whole pack it's very expensive so 
yeah uh it's it's uh definitely great so yeah i definitely recommend it and yeah buying for that down in the description below if you want to buy it along with all of our social media pages down in the description so if you're in a job physical alternative bricks i'll put a link down in the description below as well but thanks for watching i'll be seeing you very soon